What up guys, Master Yobaji, I'm back at again with another deck combo video. I almost said deck profile. Another combo video. So this is for speedroids. Uh, this is this is going to showcase you, um, I'm going to showcase a couple one card combos. One is going to be Hound and one is going to be Terror Top. So we're actually going to start off with Terror Top uh, because Terror Top, I believe, is just dope. So we're going to start off with him. Um, so one card combo. Terror Top basically says that if you control no monsters, you can special summon him. I'm going to set my, this is pretty much my end board right there, but special summon Terror Top. Terror Top is going to add to my hand one speedroid. So we're going to search for the marble machine. Searching, 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 and there we go. So I'm going to normal summon the marble machine. His effect's going to activate, and I'm going to search for the Taki Tom board. So I'm going to add him to hand. I don't know why I'm shuffling because I'm not playing against anybody. But so I'm going to use Taki Tomborg's effect, special summon him. Next, I'm going to use his effect to tag out. And I am going to tag in a Daiko Duke. So we've got Den Den Daiko Duke, special summon him in defense. Next, what we're going to do is take the Duke and the Marble Machine. Marble Machine's going to go over here. Daiko Duke's going to go to the grave. And we're going to special summon the uh, Hagoidia or Hagoida, however you want to pronounce it. And if there is a correct pronunciation, please tell me. Um, but we're going to special summon him up. Next, what we're going to do is we are going to go ahead and we are going to link these away. We're going to link these away into the rubber band shooter. Now, the rubber band shooter is going to activate, and I am going to go ahead and I am going to send, uh, I'm going to banish a level seven, no, I lied, a level five. What are you at, level five? Chambora. So we're gonna ban the Chambora, and I have a dice, a die. But I am going to just assume that I am making all the correct rolls and all the best rolls, and just for argument's sake, I'm gonna pretend I'm, you know, my opponent doesn't have hand traps. Obviously, if you're playing in a real setting, they're going to have hand traps. You're going to have dice rolls. Um, but I'm just going to showcase the best possible scenarios for your deck, um, for your plays, just so that way you can get a grasp of how to combo out. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and uh, Rubber Band Shooter is going to allow me to add to my hand either Double Yo-Yo or Red Eye Dice. So what's going to happen here? Normally, you dice roll odds evens. That's how I do it. Um, and then I did actually roll an odd, so I would go and add him to my hand, him to my grave, normal, special him, target him, turn him to level two, and then I'm going to link, uh, sorry, synchro these away into the cork shooter. Cork shooter is going to go ahead and add back both copies, one and two. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and turn him to a level six. And I'm going to go ahead and synchro these guys away into one of my beautiful ghost rares, uh, Clear Wing. Okay, then Clear Wing and High Speed are going to go ahead and become <clears throat> the Crystal Clear Wing, which is an Omni Negate. Actually, no, I lied. He's, Omni He's Spell and Trap, I think. Uh, let's see, once per turn, your opponent activates a monster effect, you can... Uh, duh, 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 duh. gains attack. Uh, but yeah, he negates spell and traps. So he's not an omni negate, he's a spell and trap negate. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to activate from my grave the Daiko Duke's effect to banish him, special up the Quirk Shooter. Next, I'm going to extend by specialing up the Hagoidia because I have a tuner on field. He's a tuner. Next, I'm going to synchro these suckers away and get into my Crystal Wing. Now, I did that with one card. I had one card in my hand, which is Terror Top, ends on a monster and a spell and trap negate. So I put him in defense because if my opponent decides to be a dick and open up Lightning Storm, because it's Yu-Gi-Oh, every time you have one specific uh, thing that's going to kill you, your opponent is just going to draw it. So I go in defense, saves me time, energy, and um, my sanity. So basically you go into defense, and then you don't have to worry about negating that because they pop the ban shooter, who cares? I play another one the extra deck, whatever. Then you can try to negate things that are more impactful. So uh, I'm going to show you guys how to set up for another 
I'm, I'm gonna call this card a 1.5 card combo. Uh, simply, simply it's a 1.5 card combo simply because you have to discard a card. So uh, normally, you know, you can't really call it a one card. Uh, you really only need one specific card, but it's technically, I'd say, a 1.5 card. So this is the Speedroid Ultra Hound combo. Summon a normal summon hound. Hound's effect is going to be to send one Speedroid card from deck to grave. I'm going to send the trap. Okay? We trap in here. What's going to happen is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to activate the trap's effect. Special summon him. Decrease his level. I believe it's by one. Let me double check. Yep. Target one level two or higher monster, reduce level by one. He is a level one. Um, I do know my cards, but sometimes like reiterating what they do off the top of my head is weird. Like I know specifically that this is going to make a level three, but how it does that, I had to read and double check. Um, so basically we're going to go ahead and we are going to synchro out into the cork shooter. Now, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to search instead of special summoning. This one's going to be different. We're searching. We're searching. We're searching for a speed droid wheel. Okay. So what we're going to do is this is where we have that one card in hand. doesn't matter what it is. We're going to pitch that one card. Activate speed droid wheel. Now, normally, I mean, you got to get at least, I'm going to say here to even make this work, you've got to get at least a three or higher. Okay. And I rolled it off my desk and got a five. So we roll a five. So what are we going to do with that information? We are going to go ahead and we are going to special summon out Daiko Duke. And we're going to special out Marble Machine. Now, again, we're, I'm going on the assumption that my opponent might have a hand trap. But I'm showing you guys the, the combo with the best routes and no stops. Again, you're doing this with one card, so if you were to get stopped, odds are you're going to have some form of extension, um, be that in the form of another Speedroid wheel, uh, maybe a Taka Tombor, Car Turbo, whatever. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take this and this, and we're actually going to go ahead and we're going to make the rubber band shooter. Rubber Band Shooter is going to go ahead and banish a level 7. I'm actually going to go ahead and banish the Fast Dragon. That's the only reason I play him is just to ban, uh, banish water. And I'm going to go ahead and add to my hand the Double Yo-Yo and the Terror Top. Terror Top must be over here. Terror Top. Okay, as usual, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to dice roll. I'll add him to my hand on odds, add him to my hand on evens. I roll. I want to get the best one. Okay, he goes to grave. Special summon him out. Teratop's going to add to your hand a... Let me see here. Since we didn't use it yet, we're going to go ahead and add a... Talk to Tom Borg. So now our goal for this one is to go double crystal wing. Double crystal wing is not going to be that hard to achieve with this. And I'm going to show you why. So first, I'm going to use Taka Tomborg's effect. Special summon him. Send him to the grave. And then I'm going to bring out the Red-Eyed Dice. Now, Red-Eyed Dice is going to go ahead and target the yo-yo. Make the yo-yo a level 6. No, I lied. Make him a level... No, don't, don't do anything. Just stop talking. So I'm going to make him a level uh, nothing. He's just going to stay a 4. Sorry, I'm stupid. Add Hagoidia, because he's level 5. Four and one equals five. So you don't change him at all. You just don't even activate his effect. Go into him. Him and him are going to become your first crystal wing. You're then going to go ahead and activate the effect of Daiko Duke from Grave, banishing him to special summon a tuner. You're going to special back the cork shooter. And then you're going to go ahead and activate the effect of the Hagadia that we just special summoned because you have a tuner on field. Special him. And then send him right back to the grave for a double crystal wing synchro dragon. Do I need to say more? Pretty simple, very consistent. Um, doesn't take a lot to make these. Obviously, one card ends you with that one and a half cards. Um, again, you might need an extender here or there to fix 
any, I guess, negation or even just playing through hand traps or playing through bad luck and getting not the rolls that you need. But it's a fun deck. It's consistent. It's really, really fun. It's really, really easy to pick up. It's a good deck for beginners. It's not too mental, mentally taxing. Um, but it, like I said one more time, it is a lot of fun. Um, it is. I find it more fun to play pure decks. And on most of my channel, that's all you're going to find. Pure, I guess, maybe anime build. You might even call it a character deck. I mean, look at that beautiful, beautiful play mat. It's amazing. All right, guys, it's Master Your YGO. We are out. Stay tuned for the next video. I don't know what it is yet. I'm thinking maybe Noble Knights, if I can get a mat that fits the aesthetic. So, guys, check out uh, the other vids on my channel. If you like pure Shadals, I've got a pure doll build. Uh, heroes, whatever. Check it out. Stay tuned for the next video. Um, like, comment, subscribe. And if there's anything I can add to these combos, please tell me. I like I like new information. Um, trying to keep as pure as I can. Uh, Master YGO out.